folks. We're here today demonstrating a product from a company called Hamburg Holland, which is located in the Netherlands. They make a smart steer implement steer system, a GPS implement steer, and it's designed exclusively to work with the Ag Leader uh, display. And what I've got set up uh, showing you is an in command 1200 in split screen mode. Uh, where we have the Hamburg Holland uh, controls on the right, the standard uh, auto steer guidance on the left of your screen. We've got a 24 row John Deere planter. It's an Ag Leader GPS 6500 and relay, and then also with a Pro Tracker swingable hitch is what we're controlling the planter with, side by side, to keep it on track. What I've done here, and I'll show you, I have set up a curved pattern on my auto steer, and then have um, done a 30-foot uh, swath width, uh, so I want to overlap half of the planter over top of where I planted before and then we'll get a good idea of how well it keeps the row on top of row as we go through the field. So we're ready to start here. I've got my auto steer, my smart steer system engaged. I engage my auto steer on the tractor and that tells the smart steer system to drive to the line. Put my Planter in the ground. Okay, and then we're off. So hopefully, with the sun, it's kind of low this morning, but hopefully, you can see those. We're going to come up on a uh, pretty good curve here. Just a little over five mile an hour this morning. Okay, we're going around the curve. We've got a left hand turn here, and then we'll have a right hand turn. Take a look at your colders. So the front colders on this John Deere planter are offset two inches. And so you'll see them running to the side of the row, the previous row. And hopefully you can get an idea how well that's keeping that lined up as we go around the curve here.